Make sure to be a member on the channel, link is in the description. Hello guys, once again it's Matt and today we have another video. So, yeah, let's thank our members as always. <laughs> Silami, Astropub, Diap, Chala and all the Fishpad members, thank you. It helps a lot, make sure to be a member, make sure to join our Discord and subscribe. So let's get into it. So today we have some gameplay with the F4, uh, the British F4s and the uh, Italian F4S uh, ASA. Uh, but I actually wanted to, to talk a little bit about a topic that why we actually need, we need the, the Tornado ADV right now. I did a video yesterday saying that it is a prediction and a lot of people agree with me uh, that probably it will, it will be added, you know. Uh, and today we are going to talk about why it needs to be added. So uh, basically I wanted to show some gameplay with these nations and to show a little bit that they need kind of an upgrade, you know. Um, yeah, don't mind me uh, in this match that I'm using only missiles. Uh, the next match I will be using the cannon as well. But it doesn't change the fact that it is kind of... I mean, you it's not something that it's impossible to play it well, you know, uh, with these aircraft. Uh, with Especially with the F4. But it is just a tiny bit difficult. And even though... It's something that I kind of don't agree with in Gaijin perspective sometimes uh, because they actually normally they add stuff that needs to be added sometimes, you know, uh, like missiles and stuff like that they use for balancing purposes and there is a whole bunch of things that they add just because it's a, in a need of the game, you know. But to be honest, I think most of the fun things that we have in game are not because they are needed in game, it's because they they're cool, you know, and, and they should be at it anyway, you know. So, uh, yeah, the, F4, uh, the F4s, for example, here, are not the greatest aircraft for a while now, to be honest. Uh, it's been a certain amount of time that they're not the top tier anymore. And it's fine, you know, uh, it's not everything that has to be a top tier aircraft. Uh, but I think the England, uh, the, the UK... <laughs> And in the Italian trees, uh, they kind of there's deserve a little bit of love, you know. Uh, even though the Americans already have the F-14, and we will probably see some fourth generation coming for the Russians, I think. Uh, as I said, <coughs> sorry, uh, as I said, the MiG-25, maybe the MiG-29, and I think it's just uh, it's best the the test of just being very cool, you know, to have the tornado and now it's actually a, a needing option so that's why it's one of the reasons that I think we really will see the tornado coming in this patch I mean, it is an interceptor has the BVR, very good BVRs, better versions of the Sky Flash and, and yeah man, I think uh, these two nations, especially uh, the UK uh, but uh, Italy, I mean, especially Italy, to be honest, because even though it, they have the F-104S, you know, uh, which has M9Ls, one of the only aircraft that has the M9Ls in the game, and it can be very, very good if you use it correctly, uh, it is not an easy aircraft to fly, and the same can be said about the British Phantoms. The Raiders are not very good, you know, they are very old Raiders for the top tier they don't have the best missiles in the game. The Sky Flash, even though it is a monopulse, uh, inverted monopulse seeker, and it is very good dogfighting missile, it doesn't have a lot of burn time, and it's just a very bad missile at longer ranges, you know. So it becomes a thing of just a needing thing, you know. Uh, even though, as I said, normally Gaijin adds stuff that they need, and that's probably another reason that it should be added you know because it, not that it should be added but uh, probably another reason that why it is coming probably and that's just why it, because it needs you know uh, but as you see here it's not something that it is not a bad aircraft you can kill everything with it and it's fine but uh, it always can be improved you know and I think a lot of people complain about this with Gaijin that actually the game 
focus a lot of on the USSR kind of things and the US and there's a reason for that it's because they actually made a lot more aircraft than the other nations but when an opportunity like this comes they have to grab it you know and I think the tornado is the perfect opportunity to just enjoy the the UK tree and the Italian tree of course uh, we have the Germans as well with the IDS but you know what I mean uh, we need the ADS uh, the ADV I mean sorry uh, for the UK and Italy because they actually use that version you know so for example the IDS version for the Germans would be just a kind of a bomber with two M9s just so it's not a very very good air to air option to have it but they could add it as well I think Germany is not in the in, a, in the same position as the as the Italians and the British to be honest because they have the MLA which is one of the best aircraft in the game very similar radar to the MLD and just a very very good position in game right now and the UK even though has two F4s uh, and they were the best F4s in the game for a while before the Kai was added and other versions but it just becomes a thing of a problem you know um, because to be honest they kind of even though they kind of have a problem with uh, having aircraft to add for certain nations minor nations as I said before uh, they are not the US and USSR we obviously have less aircraft than uh, the US and the I mean the, the, the minor nations will have less aircraft than the US and the USSR because obviously the size of the, the, the nation and stuff like that the, because they were uh, developed you know in, in the research departments and you know development departments of uh, aircraft uh, with many many bureaus or companies so yeah it's a thing that it, we have to get used to it uh, minor nations we receive less aircraft than bigger nations that's just a normal thing but when we get to those minor nations time you know they need to to, to be able to get in there and get the av the, the, the aircraft or the tanks and stuff uh, and this is one of the 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 times that this can come you know it's like the mirage 2000 for example uh, we already had a problem with the mirage f1 that took so much time and I kind of don't agree with the idea of being too late for the party, you know. But uh, the F1 is kind of too late to the party. Uh, and it has some weird missiles. Uh, the Magic 2 doesn't have the IRCCM. And the the Super 530F, uh, it doesn't have the, the ability to actually filter out chaff. So, yeah, it is a problem, you know. It is a problem. And as you see, you can kill people with the... F104 with the F4, a lot of F14s, especially with the M9Ls here. But it is just one of those times that they cannot pass this opportunity of adding an, an amazing aircraft and actually making a little bit of money, actually, to be honest, because you know the amount of people that actually want the tornado is very, very large. I would say that there's more people wanting the tornado than probably the F16, for example, right now so yeah how did i miss that but it's just a matter of uh what people want to be honest and i think it would be very very good to 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 be the addition and i think gaijin needs to add it uh maybe uh when i mean i'm posting this video today well while, while i'm recording the same day that i'm recording but Maybe later today or maybe in other day we can see the vlog for the tornado and this video will be out. But still, <laughs> uh, it is just my opinion that we really, really need the tornado right now. It's an opportunity that we cannot miss. And I think um, it's just an opportunity missed. It's like the, the MiG-25 as well. I'm going to make a video on that as well. But it is just such a perfect opportunity to add that, that, that aircraft that they cannot lose that, you know. They have to grab it and post it on the air, on the on the game. Uh, of course, this is my opinion. Obviously, they will do whatever they want. Uh, but this is my opinion on many years that I play the game and what I think the uh, the game actually needs. You know, and 
could really do. Uh, another reason, for example, here is that uh, the only aircraft that actually can do proper BVR with the the two aircraft that can do proper BVR in the Italian tree are aircraft that you cannot use the cannon while you're doing it. So it is a very limited aircraft, even though it has the Aspide, has the A9Ls, uh, it has a very, very limited radar. And as you see, the A9L can do certain weird things as well. So if you are not on top of your game, you cannot play this game correctly with these aircraft. Uh, over, obviously they are fun to fly, but yeah, we should really get Tornado ADV, you know, but I hope you enjoyed Let me know in the comments what you think and yeah, I see you guys on the next one. So bye guys. See ya